slowing the lever to prepare for a slow speed pass. While the unsick wings can fly at more than twice the speed of sound, slow speed control abilities is just as important for those who fly them. As he approaches show center, notice the aircraft's gray paint. Well, that's designed to make it more difficult to pick up visually in conditions raining from bright skies to go over.
took the his load of running gear, and he approaches the runway, who would accelerate to about 150 miles per hour, and then went to the F-16 to stop at less than 3,000 feet if necessary. And it's the building to take, to take off a relatively short runway, and you have a fighter that can operate from thousands of airfields in virtually every country in the world. Well, today's demonstration shows you just how well the F-16 come into their combat. But we cannot show you the striking power, and the accuracy, and the reality of the weapons that it carries. So now the gun hit plays well outside of the range. They're flying faster than the spin of sound. And it's the bird he's provided by Global Canopy. And you have one of the world's best single street multi road fighters. Ladies and gentlemen, the F-16 fighting Falcon played a vital role in the defense of this nation during the past two decades. It has greatly increased air combat command to build it. It is commitment at the Air Force's quick reaction force. Helping to give the Air Force global reach, global power, and insurance ability to meet any challenge anywhere under any circumstances. And now, on behalf of the Commander of Air Combat Command, General John Corey, we thank you for being with us today, and we hope that you have enjoyed taking a brief look at your F 15 Fighting Falcon. Major Parker, myself, as well as our supply and maintenance crew, will be happy to answer any questions you might have about the F-16 Air Combat Command or yours, United States Air Force. Thank you, thank you, South Carolina, and enjoy the rest of the show. Look at how fast it turns. I know. We're Joe Moore up here in Aspen for the F-16 this afternoon. And Joe, you're coming back later, right? We're going to fly this airplane again. That's your demonstration plane. Well, so the water there, we're up there this afternoon. You see the gentlemen and ladies in white t-shirts and golf carts. Anyone in uniform? Thank them. You don't know what they've gone through the past week with a